Wow, this is awesome. This looks nothing like home, right? It's totally radical. Extreme? We'll see. Boys and girls, adventurers all, welcome to another episode of Toy Gear! Today, Jesse, Max, and Jay will test the off-road pedal go-karts from Burr. Jesse takes the Berg Explorer XT3. The XT3 has extra-large off-road tires for really good traction, three gears for all conditions, and a front spoiler that will keep the mud flying away from you. Max already had a feeling that they would race in the woods, and that's why he chose the Berg Safari AF, which commands attention. Very impressive with his huge tires and camouflage paint job. Jay chose the Berg Explorer Extreme. With this pedal go-kart, you can tackle anything, which Jose Gerardo proved clearly. He pedaled 10,500 miles from Paris to Johannesburg. The trip was tough, but the pedal go-kart proved to be indestructible. Ready, set, go! And they're off! It seems that our motocrosser is the first to leave. Look at how the dirt sprays in that first turn. This is a good track for the Berg Explorers and the Berg Safari go-karts. The test team makes short work of the long straightaway. Whoa! What a jump! That was close! Max on the Safari pedal go-kart has the lead heading down the first hill. The uneven ground is no problem for Jesse with her Explorer XT3. Thanks to the oversized off-road tires and their super grip, she takes the lead in the first turn. Coming out of the turn, it's clear why the Explorer is called Extreme. Jay takes the lead of a few seconds when they come to the bumpy part of the track. Looks like Jay wants to maintain his lead. Check it out! There's another amazing jump! But will this end well? Max pays no attention. He's focused on pedaling his Berg Safari AF to victory. Right now, it doesn't matter that they're test teammates, nor that they're friends. Jay on the Berg Explorer Extreme will not concede victory so easily. Jesse's Explorer XT3 is equipped with a roll bar, a spoiler, and three gears. Don't count her out of the race just yet. The motocrosser is caught up, but I doubt he'll be the first to finish. The test team must make it through the sand, heading for the finish line. Down the final hill they go, but there's our motocrosser again. Oh, this is going to be close. And it's Jay, with Max and Jesse finishing close behind us. And there's our motocrosser. What a race, and what a success for the Bird Pedal Go-Karts. Geez, man, I'm completely exhausted. It would have been impossible without the off-road tires. Where's Max, by the way? Either Max can't stand losing, or he wants another go at the track. Looks like this time, Max will take the Bird Freestyler for a test run. With its two-wheel drive, the Freestyler truly is the quad among the pedal go-karts. The compact frame, the high seat, and the handlebars give you the perfect tools to easily do the coolest stunts. The Bird Freestyler is awesome on any riding surface. Sorry guys, I was all kicked up. I had to keep going. Yeah, those were cool stunts, man. Hey, Max, do I see an empty seat behind you? Yeah, hop in my back seat. I'm a freestyler. Okay, it's time for the final test. A test between two Berg pedal go-karts that your dad or mom would love to ride to. The Jeep. Racing through the mud, cruising through the woods, and racing through the water. Sounds like fun! Hey guys, are you up for less last big test for Toy Gear? These jeeps can do anything, so what do you want to do? Up ahead, there's a big herd of elephants. Let's see how strong these jeeps really are. But how did you then get in there? By foot? Ah uh, yes, but you will carry my stuff. Yeah, sure. Elephants? Max is totally nuts. Although with these guys, nothing surprises me anymore. It doesn't surprise you either. Cool. Watch the next episode of Toy Gear, the show where our test team demands the best results from the pedal go-karts from Berg. If it's on a sandy motocross track, in the woods, or on a racetrack, we are there. Can't wait? Go to bergtoys.com.